Hey, Jonathan here at Topsaw. Um, this channel is all things wood, so if you're new here and you like this, think about subscribing. Um, today I'm going to go over the Zubot by Silky Handsaw. I've had this one on my tree climbing saddle for a long time. I love it. And then I finally bought the new one. Um, these things are a lifesaver. They're actually also a safety tool to have with you up in the tree. So today I'll go over the difference between the old and the new, a little bit of a product review, how well it works, and then some climbing video and how it could really save you in the tree. <laughs> So here's my old one. I've been climbing with this for a really long time. Um, the last to keep it in there is worn out. So when it gets turned upside down, it just falls out. There's a ton of pitch on here that could get cleaned off. I think I've had it sharpened once, um, but it needs another sharpening. So the scabbard's worn out. The blade's pretty dull. Um, this piece broke off. And the replacement blade's pretty doable. Um, I think it's like 30 bucks, and the replacement scabbard's like 30 bucks. But the whole brand new one is only 80 bucks. I just replaced the whole thing. A couple things that are new on this is it does have these tie in points. So these tie in points are on the side, so you could tie it to your leg if you want. It actually has a lot nicer roller inside here and an additional roller right here you can see the housing of it so that's a new piece to the scabbard so it rolls really nice and then this one well i guess it's not a hundred percent upside down it's pretty pretty tight in there it's not coming out at all um, but it has a nice thumb push to get it out it does have that quick release this actually looks better made than the previous one this is rubber not the nylon like this one and I think that buckle lock-in is actually better than this old buckle lock-in. You can just see the size of it. Um, nothing worse than losing your saw out of a tree. It's really kind of just a black mark on you when you do that. In the tree climbing competitions, if you drop your hand saw, whether it's in the scabbard or not, it's an automatic disqualification. So the scabbard's a lot nicer. The new tie-in points, the new tie-in points, the rollers in it, all better made. And it's going to have a nice new blade. Um, it does have the tie-in point on the top of it here. It has a recess hole, so the rope's going to lay flat in there, which is kind of a nice improvement. And uh, I really like the way it pops out this way. So it's always hard to replace a tool that works well, um, but this is a good change. First cuts. These little sapling growths are impossible with the chainsaw, but one cut, even on even on a three-quarter inch one, look at this. No trouble at all. And on pruning, especially on fruit trees, nothing beats these uh, silky zubots. You can see. I mean, not only is it super fast and easy, but look how perfectly clean that cut is, really with no work at all. This is me doing some tree work. I'm removing this live oak over that barn in the lower right corner of the screen, and I'm roping it back to the black oak behind me. So I'm climbing with that new silky Zubot saw. Um, I saw the price on it actually is closer to 70 bucks on Amazon, so I'll put a link there. And here I am climbing with my still chainsaw and I cut through that limb, it swings back to that black oak, misses the barn. I do feel like a handsaw is an essential part of being an arborist or tree climber. It's a big safety feature, it's really useful. You can uh, grab limbs with one hand, cut with a handsaw and then throw limbs. And it's also a good safety device. Watch on this limb right here. It's roped off. Here they are tightening the lowering rope up. And I cut through with my chainsaw. And I pinch the blade on the back there. I can't get my saw out. And that's me using the Zubot to cut that limb free. 
So I pinched that blade. It would have really been a pickle any other way to get my saw out. Um, and you can see as soon as I cut through with a handsaw, the limb dropped to the rope and my saw is ready to go. Didn't pull the chain off, no problems at all. It was kind of silly of me to get the chain pinch. I was trying to do more of a swing cut, so more on the side rather than from the top. So there, there's a Zubat in action in the tree. Uh, I really like the Zubat a lot. I give it 10 out of 10 on a review. It's the new one is substantially better than the old one I have, and it is certainly the best arborist climbing saw that I've ever come across. So if you like this video, hit like, uh, and you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and hit subscribe. I'd like to hear your thoughts on that silky Zubat in the comments below. So please comment and thank you for watching.